God says, I can, change your complicated family situations. In John chapter 4, we read about a Samaritan woman, who was in need, her life was a neglected life. Since her husband died and then remarried that happened to her five times, the man who lives with her now also not her husband. She was very vexed with her life. The Jews despised the Samaritans as an inferior caste. The Samaritan women, in general, go to their village well in the morning to fetch water, but she must have suffered a lot among the other women of this village. That girls ignored her and left from her. In Saint Maria, shame, neglect, and grief must have been a constant part of her life. Because of this, she went to the well in the afternoon when no one around her. Under this circumstance, think about her surprise when she saw a man near the well. Our master, the Lord, was traveling through Saint Maria just to meet her. Moreover, Jesus was sitting and waiting to talk with her in that afternoon. Keeping his thirst at the beginning of his conversation step by step he made her to feel the need of water that gives life. In the end, the Lord used her to bring the whole village to repentance. You see, how much hope Jesus gives to those who have been neglected by the society. You may be the lowly people who are treated as downtrodden. You may not even have one person to fight for your rights. Here is the good news for you. Yes, you don't need to worry anymore. Your Savior has come for you. Prayer, our Heavenly Father, please give us the faith to wait for your rescue, even if the family's problem is magnified under altered circumstances. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, Amen.